How's it going, lads? Marshall here, and welcome yourselves back to another review on the channel. How are you guys doing? Well, I say welcome yourselves. I'm also welcoming you to the review. Lads, today, we've had some new freeze cards. St. Maximin, ASM. We have Zembele out in a freeze card. Those are in packs. We're going to focus on the SPC in this particular review, but if you do want to see anyone else, simply let me know in the comment section below. And I'll look to get them done as soon as possible, really. So, uh, yeah, if there's anyone... Just let me know that. Also, leave a like on the review if you do enjoy. Comment in the comment section below, whatever you want to say today, and I'll look to read your comments. Um, subscribe. It takes two seconds of your time to subscribe. Put the notifications on as well. And again, enjoy the review. So, I'm going to go through a Hassan, Hussein, Hassan? I think it's Hussein. Hussein Awa. Love saying his name. Love saying his name. Awa. Love it. Um, we're going to review this card today because his price, it's not that bad. His price is actually, uh, as of me recording this right now, 126 on the PS4 and 5 and 133 on the Xbox One Series X and S. Um, incredible price. Personal opinion. Now, a lot of people, I I've been looking at Twitter, saying he doesn't have the defensive abilities for a CM. Lads, he's not a CM. You've got to start looking at these cards. Like, the, per the perfect position, you can mold them in and change the squad in-game to that. Now, he's got striker. Uh, he comes out as a striker anyways. Now, he could be, and he probably will be, an amazing striker on this game. But I reckon he's the perfect can. Going back to yesterday, Lemos could be, uh, and was, a great right back. But he was a better CDM. So you kind of get what I'm saying about these players. They kind of focus them and uh, focus them on a good position. you just got to find out the positions for these cards. And me, for Hussein Awa, I reckon that position will be a cam. As you can see by the player bio, he's got four-star combo, four-star skills, four-star weak birds, height to medium work rates, and he's 5'9 in terms of heights. In terms of the attributes, he's got 89 acceleration, 85 sprint speed. Fantastic right there. And I've stuck a hunter on him. Mainly... Well, to, to boost the speediness. Oh, lads, on this game, pace is nearly everything, but it's not everything. I adapt to every single review so I can test them out to, to the kind of max. Uh, but, um, yeah, pace is very important on this game. Should he be playing as a CM, you obviously look for like a shadow or something like that to boost his defensive stats. Uh, anchor, if you want to boost his strength. Uh, I reckon he's going to be quite weak anyway. The frame, what, what kind of frame does he have? Uh, he's got lean. Yeah, lean, lean on this game, you normally get pushed over because lean is skinny, stuff like that. You normally get pushed over with a lean body type. So, again, regardless of strength, I reckon he's going to get pushed over regardless. Uh, in terms of shooting, he's got 92 attack and position and 89 finishing. Fantastic. 86 shot power, 88 long shots, 80 volleys, and 83 penalties. The passing is good as well. And I don't think this needs a boost up in any way, shape, mean, or form. 89 vision, 90 short pass, 85 long pass, 85 curve, and that is fantastic. The dribble is also really, really good. Now, I reckon he could possibly benefit from an engine, boost up uh, the agility balance, uh, even the dribbling. Uh, his agility is 86, the balance is 87, the reactions are 84, ball control and dribbling are both 89, with the composure coming in at 86. He's got 80 head and accuracy, 70 jumping, but you're not you're going to use him for like headers, but mainly, maybe you can score stuff like that. 84 stamina, very good for camp position, 74 strength and 74 aggression. As for the player traits, Dude, he's got the traits, man. Finesse shots, flare, and outside of foot shot. That's what you want for any playmaker finisher on this game. Those are the stats that you want. Well, the, the traits that you want anyways. And those are literally perfect. So the formation we're going to play today is going to have him as a striker as a false nine, I believe. And so it's going to be the four triple two. Uh, he's going to play playing striker alongside Memphis, of course, his teammates. But uh, you can see by the instruction I've got on him, lads, false nine. So he's going to stay forward, but he's going to drop in behind the pie. So it's going to be like this, and then he's going to drop. He's, he's going to do something like that uh, each and every single time. So he, he will he'll kind of float around the center forward slash cam position, which, in my personal opinion, just looking at our cards, it looks like the perfect cam on this game. But lads, let's get into it. Let's see if he is that perfect cam. Nice, Marquinhos. Molly. I, I didn't even trigger that run, boys. That is all automatic. That actually shocked me there, you know. That actually shocked me because the second I got the ball with the striker, it was his fellow striker, Memphis Depay. He was pointing exactly where he was making the run. Normally, I've got to press L1 on the PlayStation, LB on the Xbox to trigger those runs, but not there with Hussem Awa. One, go for the two. What a back heel, left foot. Oh, he's got the finish too. 
That was his weak foot, boys. Four star weak foots. Hussam Awa. Back of the net. Come on, boys. That's a great finish. Great run yet again. His movement is really, really good. And uh, that was his first shot I've had with Awa. And it sails in the back of the net. I am finding him in space a lot, you know. Oh, what a first touch. Oh, oh go on. Chip. Oh, exquisite, man. Let's go, Awa, pal. Like I said, I, I am finding him in space a lot. His technique is literally incredible. And that chip. Pretty spectacular, boys. Pretty spectacular. One. Go for the two. I don't know whether I go for the finesse or the cutback. I went for the first one. Hey! Hat trick for Awa, boys. You see the ball, ball roll as well. Always in control. His ball control's nuts. So he's, he's quick on the dribble. He's quick on the ball at his feet. He's got a good finish. This guy's a cam. This guy's a great, great cam. How are again? Look at that close control, man. Lovely. That's Marquinhos. I thought... I didn't know who that was. I thought it was a skill and it was Marquinhos. He won the ball back there. Here is our Finesse from there. Oof, trying the finesse shot trait. Little flick. On the volley, son. Ooh, we're testing these. Oh, what a pass. Nobody's seen that coming. No one's seen this coming. Oh, what? Good save, tapping. Good save, tapping. I don't like scoring rebounds. Dude, I had him all ends up there. He didn't know what day of the week it was. He's won it back as well. Neymar! Hey, that was mainly all Awa, but a great finish by Neymar, boys. Oh, nice from Volland. I haven't reviewed Volland, by the way, on the channel. Because I've just unlocked him today. A lot of people have been asking for him, too. But here is Awa! Dude, left foot, right foot, it doesn't matter! It does not matter! This guy's an assassin, boys. Assassin. Sometimes he misses chances that you could easily score. But uh, it's probably user error. It's probably my fault, but um, it's another great finish on his weak foot there by Hussam Awa. Volland's not bad. Look at Awa's run, man. Undefeated. Oh, go on, Awa. He's through. Under the keeper. A little bit of control. A little bit more control. A little bit of finishing. Oh, I do like this card, boys. You see the close control? Now you see the close control. He feels responsive. That's what you want from players on this game. You want the game to feel responsive. And Awa's making it feel responsive. And you would have seen there, Fick to go inside, went back on the right, finishes in the bottom corner. Responsive. So there we have it, lads. That wraps up another review for the channel. And it is Freeze Awa. Now, Awa was really good. It's really good. I'll, I'll be interested to see what his actual record was. Two, go two games, five goals. Uh, that's, that's impressive. Uh, he could have got assists, but... Um, his passing was good, so I just missed chances with other strikers. Uh, what he was good at was the technical dribbling. Honestly, his dribbling, sensational. Absolutely sensational. And I loved his close control. Like, what is his ball control? 89. Dude, he was so quick on the dribble too. You can definitely feel that. Uh, he is quite weak. I will say that much. We'll get into pros and cons right now. He is quite weak, lads. So just watch out for that. I know it says 74 strength, but... It really feels like 64-54 because of his body type being lean. So uh, just watch out for that. Uh, another thing is his aggression is not bad. He does win challenges back. And he does bundle through tackles due to the aggression. And um, he's just really, really good in that sense. His attack and positioning and his movement is flawless. And that is a pro. One more con before getting the rest of his pros. His versatility. As a CM, you need a player as an attacking CM. Defensive stats aren't good enough for a box-to-box -box midfielder uh, winning the ball back and stuff like that for your team. It's just not that good defensively. So what you want to do is have a defensive mind player alongside him, maybe like a Marquinhos, for example, in a 4-4-2 formation, and uh, use him as a CM that way. But I don't think he's that versatile to play in a number of different positions on this game. Cam, however, striker, center forwards, this guy nails it. Um, the pros then, you've got the acceleration, down with T's. Acceleration's phenomenal. Goes 99 with 100 chem style. Definitely suggest that chem style, by the way. Uh, his dribbling is phenomenal. Absolutely phenomenal. If you want to improve it, 
Uh, I mean, you could easily put, stick an engine on him or something like that, and that would improve it ninefold, but honestly, it's really, really good. His movement is sensational, and his passing is incredible at times, with a 90 short pass and 89 vision. Uh, so all in all, there's an overall rating for this Awa, who has amazing traits as well, by the way. Um, he's a really good player, so all in all, Adding everything up that I've talked about and stuff like that. I'm going to give him a rate of a 9.0. I reckon this SBC is quite worth. Uh, 9.0 is what I will give him. Awa stands out. He stands out. He feels a bit like, I don't know, like a striker Mertens. A striker kind of Insignia type of player. He feels like those kind of players with the close control but silky and nimble. Uh, that's what he kind of feels like. So if you want someone to, to kind of compare him to, I'd definitely say Dries Mertens of uh, Napoli. Uh, in terms of enjoyment, he will get a rating of an 8.8. .8. Um, I, I even spoke about it during the commentary. I was having fun with the card at the time. Um, yeah, it's just fun. Like, What's not to have fun with stats like that and performances like he performed in the games I did play? Uh, five goals over the course of the two matches. Uh, value 8.8. .8. It's one of those that I think is value in this freeze promo and there hasn't been too, too many where I thought you know what? I'm going to do this SBC before I do the try before you buy loan version. And I just went out and did the SBC. It's an 85 rated team. No informs, nothing like that. Um, so I went and did it because I reckon it could have been worth. And I'm just glad that I know he is worth. 8.8 .8 is what he's getting. And the meta rating, which boosts the value up to, uh, is a 9.0 for the meta rating. So in terms of the meta, what you're looking at is a composition. Dribbling, passing, shooting, a bit pace, the burst beyond the striker, and stuff like that. Even exceptional movement and whatnot. Lats, he's got all of them, so he is very meta for that position. And the way we go in the meta ratings is like 7, 8, 9, 10. We do it all like that. So I'm giving him a 9 out of 10. It's not like 9.3 or anything like that for the meta rating. It's just solid numbers. But Lats, he's, he's really, really good in this game. He's got perfect work rates, a four-star combo would add to his pros too. And um, he's just a joy. He's an absolute joy, lads. Uh, but that's where I'm going to leave it for the day's review. I hope you have enjoyed it, lads. If you have, once again, a like would be very much appreciated from you guys. I uh, hope you had a great day today it's it's a weird day today it's been like raining sunshine raining sunshine very weird day but i hope you have enjoyed it if you have once again leave a like on the video if you if this review has helped you in any way shape or form leave a like on the video uh drop in the comment section below who you want to review next i'm guessing a lot of you will say asm i don't know his price right now but uh i will look into that thank you very much for watching leave a like comment subscribe all the good stuff lads and i will catch you all next time